Hi, my loves. Tonight, I would like to talk about Bumpy Johnson. Ellsworth Raymond Bumpy Johnson was born October 31st, 1905. Bumpy Johnson got his nickname from a alleged bump on the back of his head. As a young child, Bumpy Johnson parents worried that his temper would get him in trouble. So when he got older, they sent him to live with his sister Mabel in Harlem. Bumpy Johnson dropped out of high school and shortly after working odd jobs, He'd begin his criminal career. Bumpy was an, an associate of and Madame Stephanie Sinclair, a numbers queen. He became Sinclair's principal lieutenant in the 1930s. Sinclair and Bumpy aimed to start a war against New York crime boss Dutch Schultz. This particular war ended with more than 50 allocations of criminal things such as things unmentioned on YouTube. You can research that a little bit more. Eventually, it ended with Bumpy getting the better end of the stick. Bumpy was very notorious, even landing a article in the 1952 edition of Jet. Surprisingly, that same year, Bumpy was sentenced to 15 years in prison. Bumpy served most of his prison sentence in Alcatraz in San Francisco, California, and ultimately getting released paroled on well in 1963. Bumpy was arrested more than 40 times and served two prison terms. In December of 1965, Johnson staged a sit-in in a police station refusing to leave and protest of a continued surveillance. He was charged with refusal to leave, but ultimately was acquitted by a judge. July 7, 1968, at the age of 62, Bumpy Johnson died of congested heart failure while under the indictment of conspiracy to sell narcotics. Bumpy Johnson was buried in the Woodlawn Cemetery in the Bronx, New York City.